Thank you, Abishé. Thank you, David Bonin. And thank you, Actors Studio. I think today, first and foremost, is a very memorable day because of the memorandum of understanding that has been signed between these two institutions. For an institution like Actors Studio to go forward into giving their students that one extra layer, I think is not just important, but I think it's essential. I think it is something that most other actor studios across the country should be doing. Let me give you my reasons for this. All of us are talented. So I don't have a truck with anyone's talent. When I meet new actors, when I meet new talent, and they come and say, Mr. Vaswani, we're very talented. I have no argument with your talent. I have a problem, however, with another issue. All of us, all of us, no exceptions, have mothers who are great cooks. Somebody's mother makes the best pulao, somebody's mother makes the best biryani, somebody's mother makes the best matcha jhol, somebody's mother makes the best. We all have mothers who are great cooks. None of them will open this. So, I have no argument with your talent. I have no argument with the way teachers train your talent, hone your talent, fine tune your talent. I have no argument on that level at all, God bless. How do you translate your talent into a scalable, sustainable, and successful career? How many people, first and foremost, even understand the difference between having a career as an actor or just merely doing a job as an actor? To have a scalable, a sustainable, and a successful career, you have to be able to understand how the business that you're getting into works, and you have to understand that from the inside. When I met Shah Rukh, he didn't want to do films. We met casually. We went out to see a movie. Unfortunately, he didn't have enough money to go home. He came to my house to spend the night. He spent two years. He just didn't go back. Fine. He didn't want to do films. So I was fine. I was busy making a film called Patthar Kipul in those days, in which I had launched Lorena London. Shah Rukh uh, didn't want to do films until his mother died. The whole attitude changed. He comes back home from Delhi once after the funeral is over and he says, Will you make a film with me? I said, Of course I will. I've been telling you that for months. He says, No, say it now. Otherwise, I won't make my bags inside you. I said, Bring the bags and stop me. Like he did, which he did. But we went down subsequently. Once he decided that he wanted to act in films, I had to put my thinking cap on. And everything that I'm telling you now, is everything that I told Mr. Shah Rukh Khan, is everything that the children at Actors Studios will be taught by me when they come to Ramuji Rao and be mentored. The first thing I told Mr. Khan is, do you want a film or do you want a career? Film dhundo ge to film me lege. Career dhundo ge to film dhundna chhod. Let's understand what it takes for you to become and remain sustainable in the industry. काम ढूंढोगे तो काम मिलेगा कामयाबी ढूंढोगे तो कामयाबी मिलेगी लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड द डिफरेंस बिटवीन मियरली वर्किंग फॉर अ लिविंग एंड बिकमिंग सक्सेसफुल इन व्हाट यू डू एंड देन फॉर हिम आई हैड टू अंडरस्टैंड द बिजनेस सो आई मेड द रूल्स आई सेड राजू विल बी योर फिल्म दिस इज योर साइनिंग अमाउंट यू आर स्टेइंग इन माय हाउस आई विल नॉट शूट स्टार्ट शूटिंग दिस फिल्म अंटिल यू साइन फॉर अदर मूवीज एंड आई विल डिसाइड व्हिच दोस मूवीज आर Interest. King Uncle with Rakesh Roshan. Dil Ashna hai with Hema Mali. Chamatkar with F C Mehra. Last but not the least, so the film came first. Diva with Shabnam Kapoor. None of them were lead roles. 
none of them were roles that Mr. Shah Rukh Khan could take pride in possibly. When we used to sit in the evening with other friends who were also actors, Arman Kohli, Rahul Roy, Avinash Vadhavan, Chakri Pandey, they were friends, they still are. They used to tell Shah Rukh, excuse me, what is Mr. Vivek Vaswani doing? He is quote unquote jacking your career. Arman would say, I have five movies when I'm playing the solo hero. I have great scripts. In each film, I have five songs. And King Uncle, Mr. Vivek Vasani has a bigger role than you. What are you doing? And he'd come and tell me very transparent. What are we doing? So I said, Mr. Khan, these films that you've signed are sold. They are sold already to distributors. Not because of you. In spite of you, but they are sold. When distributors have enough faith in an actor whose four films they have assortedly and together bought, they will buy his film. Every film that these other people have told you, friends though they are, are unsold. And I'm sorry to say most of those films have remained unsold, though we're talking 30 years later. King Uncle did not sell because Shah Rukh Khan was acting. It sold because Rakesh Roshan was making it. It sold because a superstar called Jackie Shroff was playing King Uncle. Divana sold because Vishy Kapoor was a very good star. Divana sold because Nadeem Shaban had given them outstanding music. Chamatka sold because Mr. F.C. Mehra makes films and has regular distributors. And it was the 45th film that was being made by Eagle Films. There was no question that there were regular distributors. And Hema Malini's film was a multi star. There was Jitendra, there was Mithun Chakravarti, there was Amrita Singh, Dimple Kapalya, Sonu Palya, Kabir Bedi, Divya Bharti. How could the film not be so? You know? It didn't matter what he did with them. It didn't matter how good he was in those films. It didn't matter how bad he was in those films. It didn't matter whether the films were good. It didn't matter whether the films were bad and he was good. It didn't matter that the films got wrong releases. I mean, we were in the middle of a very bad period when these films released. There were riots in Bombay. Raju was released in the middle of riots. Two weeks later, when King Uncle opened, it was empty cinemas because people were still scared to go out of the house. It didn't matter because by then, Shah Rukh Khan had a stamp on his forehead that said, Sailor Bill Hero. 